I am continuing from the previous uh, chapter. Now I want to change color. I want to apply some color properties. I want to render this something like that. Okay. Now just select the particle system like this. Otherwise, go to Window Outliner. Particles is already selected. Control A. See, you will get the particle shape properties and all those things. Render attributes, all that stuff. You can increase the lifespan, times. Time attributes, you put start a value, you could end a value and the next uh, what you what color applies it to like here if you click it here, dynamic attributes you can they will ask you like this for for example per particular attributes, per object attributes, and all that stuff. Then I am applying uh, add per particular attributes, add the attribute, and you can right click create the ramp. This is somewhat complex, that's why just uh, if you want uh, two, three times choose me notes prepare your screen. If you follow that, uh, you can do practice and uh, like this. Just if you see, if you click on six, uh, you will see uh, in the viewport. Uh, see, colors are changing. Show grid, grid now just you will uh, see that. See, colors are changing. Now you change the colors uh, so that you can uh, edit the ramp. You can uh, change the ramp. Yellow color. Accept that. And then white color from red to white. Then you see how they are coming see that they are coming like this and uh, increase the number control A edit the RAM then uh, you can uh, increase the number of properties render attributes did we do all materials in the end now there is some dynamics until I want to do and check on what it is not possible to teach uh, um, entire dynamics uh, within a uh, few minutes or a few hours, uh, just one, one and a half hour, uh, I am having the time limit. So, increase the number of uh, color accumulation, then emitter, I want to increase the window outliner, I want to re release more number of particles. See, I want to make it uh, 200 this way so that uh, this is how it's coming and if you render it just to see how it is looking you won't see anything because uh, you need to change them to hardware rendering hardware rendering and better content you can uh, see something like this see this is how it's coming even sometimes you need to apply glow and all that stuff And I want to duplicate this window rendering it as hardware render buffer. You could have dynamics in the render chest hardware render buffer any so that it is uh, window attributes multipass rendering activates multipass rendering nine it has polygons motion blur one again you just uh, render that this is how they are looking and if you s see it from side view actually they are coming this way see something like this and uh, you can change the properties control A streak to multi streak and so that you will uh, current render type Something like that so this is how it is coming so you can create change now for example uh, window 
rendering headers, hardware render buffer, and just uh, see something like this it is looking and I want to render this for example uh, render render the sequence see something like this this is uh, coming and uh, attributes yes files render the frame uh, is uh, for example 120 by frame targa or something like that okay then uh, enter it again otherwise uh, something like this you can uh, I'll show the final movie in the end so that you can understand what are the dynamics and all those things even you can create this way you can change the properties and all that stuff whereas you can it looks like uh, they are going from us something like this okay very beautiful things you can create uh, I'll show you the final render version and all this stuff just I rendered now you can see this see that is what I've created small uh, visual effects kind of uh, thing means see it went to the normal gamma animate chayali model chayali and double compulsory visual effects each else in there um, you can even apply some glow effects and all those things see this you can use uh, wonderful you can create wonderful titles and all that stuff you can see I have rendered one more version uh, it is looking like this see 